Hey guys, I never mind here, and today, uh, I know I haven't done a video in a while, it's just, well, I'm gonna try to get in back into the, back into it, so today we're gonna be playing some Super Mario Odyssey on the Nintendo Switch, and we're gonna tell you how to get the King's Armor in Super Mario Odyssey if you don't know how to get it. So, there's only two steps, after I tell you them, I am gonna show you them in some clips. So, the first step, basically all you have to do is just beat the game. After you beat the game, you have to collect like a hundred and something power moons when your Odyssey wants it. After you're done with that, you can go back to your Odyssey once you get that hundred and something power moons. Set sail. You go all the way to the dark side of the moon. And we're gonna go there to show you what happens. Skip the intro. And there's also a bunch of clues in the game. Like, uh, the, no, not in the game. There's a bunch of clues on this island. Like, you don't find them wherever on the island. So if you come over here. See all these rabbits and fake vegetables? There's a bunch of clues, like this clue. Right there. They're just everywhere. Okay, so after you do that, you can come over here, and you're gonna see this little thing. That, that's because I already beat it up there. Oh, uh, you're gonna need to beat those three rabbits again. Because if you look right here, you have this rabbit, you need to defeat him, them, all. And then you have to fight that boss, it's like a weird box thing. I will show you the boss in a second. Oh, wow. Let's go up, 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 up. So you're gonna come this way. You can get that part if you already low on the other boss. Did you just fought after this? There's also a little secret over here. He give, yeah, he gives you a power moon. So you're gonna go over here. And it's gonna lead you right to the tippy tippy top. And you're gonna find the rabbits again. Which if you don't like the rabbits, this fight is it's okay. It's actually a good fight. What the? What's an armor game? Oh, my bad. So you're gonna capture him. Once you capture him, you're gonna go over here and you're just gonna nail his leg. You're gonna jump on the little, like, stairs his legs make and then just hit the person that's right there. You can also try to hit them while they're like standing. Just try to knock out the legs as fast as you can. And then just climb right back up on the uh, stair like stairs they made for you. Knock out that person. So you, you just keep on running. Actually, you probably should have jumped. So just run and jump away. So you jump. Just gotta run and jump away from this boss. At this time, you're gonna have to hit both of his legs to knock him out. So you're gonna hit that leg. You're gonna get both of them. Then you're gonna jump on this leg and hit the person right here. You're gonna have to get both of the legs again. There's gonna be more of those little sidewinding things this time. And yeah, he's gonna fall on his back. So you can break the other leg too, like I just did. Kill him. And then there you have it. You killed this boss and after you get the boss 
three power moves are gonna come down. But you have to wait for like this cutscene. So three power moves are gonna come down. And then I think like after you grab them or something, you get the king's armor. But at, after, as soon as you beat this, you're gonna get the king's armor. So thank you guys for watching this video, and we'll see you next time. And I am, I'm sorry that I haven't made a video while. I will try to post regularly now. Thank you guys for watching.